you, it is more than primary election day in three local counties. A special election is being held to fill a vacant state Senate seat. Eyewitness News reporter Mark Hiller is live in Scranton to explain. Mark? Good evening, Candace and Nick. The state Senate 22nd seat became vacant in March when John Blake resigned to work for Congressman Matt Cartwright. Now, four candidates are vying for this vacant seat. Among them is one person who is no stranger to Harrisburg. State Representative Marty Flynn of the 113th District has been serving in the State House since 2013. Flynn voted this morning in his native Scranton. On the Republican side, candidate Chris Shermack has been serving as Lackawanna County Commissioners since last year. He now wants to serve in the State Senate. His campaign came out swinging against Flynn, calling the Democrat a fraud, while Flynn's campaign countered by claiming Shermack lied about raising taxes. But it's the Green Party candidate who picked up the endorsement of the Scranton Times Tribune. That's Marlene Sebastianelli, who greeted voters this morning in Peckville. The political newcomer owns a local winery and is a health care industry consultant. She's gone on the record as opposing expansion of Dunmore's Keystone Sanitary Landfill, and that holds weight with one voter we spoke to. She was the only one who came out against the dump, and the dump is a big deal for me. I, I mean, how big are they going to make that mountain? I would prefer a, a Republican-controlled uh, Senate, governorship, local. Voters could also choose a fourth candidate, Libertarian Nathan Covington. Tonight's winner will fill out the remainder of former Senator Blake's term through November 2022. A Pennsylvania State 2nd, 22nd District is comprised of all of Lackawanna County, four communities in Luzerne County, and three others in Monroe County. Live in Scranton, Mark Hiller, 2822 Eyewitness News.